Welcome Mavericks. Hope you are safe and healthy. Today I'm here with a woman on platform 8. A story by Ruskin Bond. Well, this story is important uh, with the aspect of some students because it's there in the uh, book for the students to go ahead with. Maybe in standard 8 or in 7th as well. So, I'll talk about Ruskin Bond before I go ahead with the story, The Woman on Platform 8. Ruskin Bond is an Indian writer of British descent. He is a versatile writer. He is an expert of every genre. But talking about his favorite are two. One, short stories. That's what he is expert in. And the other one is essays. He's an expert of writing essays and he writes essays. He has written essays uh, on every possible topic from covering a variety of fields. Uh, his role has been quite acknowledgeable and so he has received a number of awards uh, starting up with Sahit Academy Award in 1992. Uh, he got Padma Bhushan Award and Padma uh, Padma Shri Award as well for all the works that he has done. So that's all about Ruskin Bond. Now, uh, before I proceed with anything that I would talk about the story, I think I should talk about the summary first. So that if you could acknowledge the story, you would be able to identify the ifs and buts that I talk about. So the story is like, I'll keep it very simple. Story is of a boy named Arun. He is uh, going to a boarding school, so he has to change trains. So he goes to Ambala railway station and uh, he has to wait there as the train is at midnight. Then he stays there and does all the odd chores that a person would do uh, spending time somehow on a railway platform alone matter of fact that is so he's just doing and then he finds a lady in white sari approaching him kindly talking to him uh, feeding him and then somehow developing a strong relationship a bonding is visible and then when after eating, they are returning from the uh, canteen, there is a small incident. The incident uh, includes another small boy who ran across the tracks and somehow fell in the tracks. Though there wasn't any engine approaching from any of the side. But seeing this, this lady who was holding Arun's hand walking across the platform held Arun's hand so tightly as if her fingers would dig in the flesh of Arun's arms. Seeing this like Arun was like about to shout and then the boy stood up and ran across the tracks and went on the other platform. And then the pressure of this lady's hand went slow. Well, that's an important incident. We'll relate to it later on. Then after a lot of conversation, she supports the lady in white sari supports Arun at every stage. They meet Satish and Satish's mother. A lot of conversation goes on. Uh, when Satish's mother stands with Satish, this lady stands with Arun and uh, once she calls herself Arun's mother as well. Arun did not reply or deny. That's another point. And then the train came at night. Satish's mother 
gave a lot of things to Satish and here she had nothing to give but Arun knew what he has gained and Arun only knew how many things this lady had given to him that day and so he wanted to give something in return and that was quite automatic just out of a flow of emotion uh, he called her mother he called her mother you cannot call anyone mother even if she does a lot of things for you she would not call her a mother but then calling somebody a mother relates a lot of cords from heart to heart and that really means something anyhow the train goes by Arun keeps on looking at the lady who is also trying to look at her despite of all the sort of talks Satish's mother is up with. So that's the end of the story. From here we know the major characters. They are Arun. He is the protagonist. The lead character of anything is called the protagonist. He is 12 years of age. You can imagine 12 years of age alone on the platform. You, I, 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 I don't think that you have ever got a permission when you were 12 years of age. Have you? If some of you are lucky enough, please mention it in the comment section. I would like to see some of your names at least. Then we have uh, that white lady, quite a mysterious character of the story, making the entire plot very mysterious. Then we have Satish, uh, a quite a normal, a good friend of Arun, we can say, and Satish's mother, who is shown to be a very boastful lady, very restricting lady. She is not liked by Arun at all. I did not even like her. I hope you did not even like her too. She was very restrictive and very boastful. Anyhow, those were the characters. There is one minor character you can say that is that small boy who ran across the tracks. All right. Then we move to plot. Here we'll stay a little bit. We'll slow down a little bit. I want you to understand plot because there is a misconception about plot. Plot is actually the basic lineup of the story. I'll give a small example. Cinderella is this thick book. However, the plot is one liner. An orphan girl harassed by the stepmother somehow meets a prince, marries him and lives happily ever after. And there is an intrusion of a fairy, a little bit of supernaturals. That's it. And so the plot of this story would be again a one-liner. A small boy who is felt like he is capable of going alone is allowed to go. And while traveling, he meets a, a, a lady who befriends him and a love and affection generates. The bonding goes strong. And that's it. That's the plot. It's there to give a theme. There is a theme and there is a message as well along with it. Alright. Before we go ahead. Before we go ahead and do anything else. Uh, I would think of going through with the summary. The woman on platform 8. I would like to have a little bit of discussion on that. First of all, I would like you to know, do you know there is no platform number 8 in Ambala railway station where this boy was waiting. There is only 7 platforms. There are only 7 platforms. There isn't any 8th platform. That's the first mysterious thing Mr. Bond has tried to create. Then we have the woman on this platform. Again, seems to be very mysterious, coming out of nowhere, suddenly. In the very beginning, when we read the story, we have no clue that even there would be a lady coming out. And that seems to be the major role. Without her, the story wouldn't be possible. So this lady. And so it justifies the title very much. 
the platform is mysterious the lady is mysterious we have a lot of questions based on this who is the lady is she a beggar is she rich or poor is she a widower is she just a, a notorious person moving on the platform is she really kind and helpful or is she a gangster or part of a gang there may be a lot of questions to it but then we'll have an answer to every question that we have don't worry i'm there all right so that was the title you can have a lot of things to it if in case you have questions related to it you please mention that in the comment section now we move to the theme that's really very 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 important the writer had a lot of themes going in his head and so he put a lot of them one after the other i might have missed some you get them add to my memory you can do that in the comment and i'll read it myself we'll take themes the first theme that i think we'll go in pairs the first thing i think goes for freedom and identity freedom the boy okay let's take identity first the boy had an identity he might have created a level of personality that he acquired that his parents understood that okay he is capable of traveling alone so he created an identity because of which he got the freedom of traveling alone so freedom of thoughts as well the child had that freedom of thinking that he can travel alone and the freedom of their parents of the freedom of their thoughts of the parents as well that they could think okay let him travel once so lot of lot of thoughts lot of freedom all right then we have the second one talks about love talks about the theme of kindness love is spread all through the story the parents love their kid arun loved his parents the lady came out of love when the lady saw that the child was alone she had some love in her heart so she came the boy reverted with love so all sort of love the lady gripped the hand of arun because she had some love and excitement in her heart because of that uh that child who fell on the tracks so love kindness we see we find kindness when the lady approaches the child and asks him offers him food another theme we can talk about is like trust the trust that the boy generates on that lady the trust that that lady had on the boy when she posed as his mother in front of satish's mother she knew the boy won't deny she had the trust and the trust of connection and the the the, uh, uh, the the theme of connection the last one all connection is like if you have any of these all these themes that i talked about are the parameters which define your life if you don't have any of these possess them they will really help you out in every stressful condition anyways these are the themes there are many more if you can figure them out that's your perception we talk about message well i'll have a one liner for the message i generated it on my own self mr bond has tried to give the message that bond of love has no boundaries it never sees anyone and it just happens what is required is politeness and love in your voice and kindness in your eyes if you simply have words and your eyes say something else that's not love and you understand it very nicely anyhow uh let's not deviate let's not go here and there so that's the message i think that we should love everyone we should not have an eye of suspicion for everything that why is he speaking so politely is there something wrong 
Fine, there could be something wrong, but there could be something right as well. So go for that was that positivity that will help. Then we have uh, like the session of queries. So I have answered most of the queries till now. What else could be the queries? Who that lady was? You can very easily explain that as if you have remembered, I have not covered the every and each and every incident of the story. There was an incident when this lady was sitting with this boy Arun on the platform and there was a small boy who was running on the platform and then that, that boy, small boy moved down in the tracks and started running across the tracks. Though there was nothing to worry as there was no engine approaching from any of the sides. But then he suddenly fell. As I said, there was no engine approaching. But then when he fell, this lady in white sari held Arun's hand which, with such pressure that like if she wouldn't have realized she had dug her fingers into the flesh of Arun's hands. It was so intense as if she was so excited when she saw that boy uh, uh, fallen on that track and she was relaxed only when she was soothed down by Arun when she uh, when he saw her behaving like that but that action of that lady proves that she had some connection with such accident she might have gone through an accident she is wearing white in India white sari refers to widowhood she might be a widow who might have gone through that accident in which she might have lost her husband she might have lost her child she might have lost her entire family and that's why she doesn't have anyone to go to and so she lives in that platform so this is my perception yours might be a different one but then you need to see it in such a way that you develop one perception so that's all about the story uh, there could be a question why did the child, why did Arun uh, accept her as a mother when she posed as a mother? Well, I can say he just had so much trust. He had so much trust on that lady. He was alone. She became his companion. He was hungry. She fed him. He was maybe hungry of good words. Kind words, gentle words. He was hungry of love maybe. And this lady gave all these things to him. And so he was very happy to uh, see her there standing beside him as a mother. And so when she posed as a mother, he was rather happy. And he accepted her because he trusted her. There could be one more question. Maybe, why did he say mother? Why did he call her mother at the end of the story? And that talks about the same. The same answer could be repeated there. So there is a give and take of a lot of emotions thrown here and there. And so, when you will read this story, don't just keep your eyes and your brain open keep your hearts open as well if you have certain questions please put it in the comment box please like subscribe and share if you like thank you